Best Benjamin Franklin Rare Prints to Collect Part 4 The One Cent Stamp Series from 1908 It was issued to give a touch of modernity To the classic profile of Benjamin Franklin Tradition of philately After 57 years The decision continued to be made to use his portrait printed on the stamps Both with a simpler and more modern looking edge design Both for the one cent rate Which satisfied the use in postcards for sending letters above the bust you will be able to see the writing us post down the nominal value of the piece one cent of the US dollar the simplicity and uniformity of the new design they significantly reduced production costs and extended the life of steel printing plates with which the machines printed the stamps series released on December 1st 1908 it had a circulation of 5,300,000 copies with a 12 serration. Today this series of six pieces it's worth $195. The one cent stamp of 1873 depicts the bust of Benjamin considered one of the founding fathers of the nation. It's part of American history. Benjamin Franklin he was also appointed as America's first postmaster general a role that allowed him to revolutionize the Postal Service in the Colonies Establishing routes between Florida and Maine As well as guaranteeing a regular service Between America and Great Britain Above the bust You will be able to see the writing Us post Down The nominal value of the piece Reported both in letters Then by number One cent of the US dollar You will be able to see that the number one It was printed with a small crescent moon on the bottom half a peculiarity that not all stamps have Another modernization of the postal system It was also the introduction of postal travel At night Between the major cities of New York and Philadelphia A service that speeded up mail delivery in the United States Postage stamp issued on August 22, 1873 It had a circulation of 448,290,000 copies With a 12 serration Today it is worth $210. The 30 cent stamp of 1914. It was issued to avoid confusion among postal workers. The post offices. They determined that all pieces of nominal value. Under 7 cents. Issued between 1912 and 1914. They were supposed to depict George Washington. While all denominations are 8 cents and above. They were supposed to depict Benjamin Franklin. Above the bust. The classic writing us post under the nominal value of the piece 30 cents of the american dollar this stamp features a new border design simple and artistic printed on single line watermarked paper he was released in april 1914 with a 12 serration today this piece is worth 220 dollars the 20 cent stamp of 1914 it's part of the series Issued specifically to avoid confusing postal workers With the issuing of various stamp tariffs Up The classic writing is shown Us post Down The nominal value of the piece 20 cents of the American dollar Benjamin As well as being considered one of the founding fathers of the nation He was also an inventor And notable scientist Which has actually brought more knowledge into the history of man Thanks to his inventions and discoveries Postage stamp issued in April 1914 Was issued in millions of copies With a 12 serration It was printed by the flat plate method Where a matrix It was printed on a flat plate And thanks to the pressure The ink drew the stamp on the paper Today this piece is worth up to $525 The pair of 2 and $5 stamps from 1918 Were printed using a single plate in fact they were the first ordinary two color stamps in the history of the united states of america both they depict the bust of the founding father benjamin franklin up they show the writing us post down the nominal value of the piece two and five us dollars the peculiarity of this couple it's on the two dollars stamp where the carmine-colored frame caused a sensation among philatelic collectors 
because they thought they had discovered a printing error in the color. A good two years passed. Due to the denial by postal officials. Confirming that the color was intended. Pair with an 11 serration. Today together they are worth $17.50. The one cent stamp of 1867. Depicts the face of Benjamin Franklin. 100 years before this piece was issued. In 1767. The Stamp Act had recently been abolished. Law imposed by the Parliament of London. Which he imposed on all the English colonies. Located in North America. To pay a tax on each printed sheet. It included books. Newspapers. Legal documents. Publications. Board cards and much more. A law. Which sparked several protests. Including that of Benjamin Franklin. That thanks to his popularity and his diplomacy. Succeeded in bringing about the abolition of this law. Under the bust. The nominal value of the piece reported in letters. Dark blue stamp. Dated 1867. Was issued on August 11th. In 3000 copies. And today it is worth $1825 on the philately market. The 5 cent stamp of 1847. It was among the first adhesive stamps. Made in the USA. Following the issue of the British Penny Black. The US Post Office. They carefully observed the world's reaction to the first adhesive stamp, a success, which the postal authorities brought to issue this temporary adhesive stamp. On the center, the face of Benjamin Franklin is shown up, the writing post office, down, the nominal value of the piece, five cents of the American dollar, stamp without perforations. It was issued on July 1, 1847 in 3,600,000 copies. Printed on flat plate. It has the particularity of being adhesive. Today one of these stamps is worth $3,000.